Okay guys, uh, this is video number two in my new series uh, called This Has Never Happened to You. And this one is a true zombie performance by an M18 Hellcat who um, got into his head that he was going to kill that T-50 no matter what. It didn't matter what the rest of his team was doing, whether his teammates needed any assistance. Uh, he just zeroed in on me and uh, loosed off, uh, you know, 13 or 14 rounds um, as he, you know, conducted a merry chase all over the battlefield here. Now, what's happened in this fight so far is we've got a Tiger II over there uh, that is, I think you can all guess, that's a ridiculous thing for a heavy vehicle to do. The Hummel and a whole bunch of other vehicles just tore him to pieces and I couldn't do anything to save him, uh, even if he was the best player in the world. Uh, you know, I could not stay here and try to help him. It was just a, um, a useless sacrifice. And uh, after he was dead, uh, you can watch the Hellcat come after me. And uh, I've been chased, you know, many times. I think this was uh, definitely one of the top three. Um, the other one was a T-20 and the greatest fight I've ever been in for sure, against a player called Rodrigo Pax in a 1375. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have that replay. I wish I did. Uh, maybe I could try to recreate it uh, sometime. But it was before the physics patch, so uh, the the moves I made in uh, the T50 um, against Rodrigo Pax, you couldn't recreate them even in a training room. So um, I'm just going to hit the space bar here and describe the action. So away we go. So, this Tiger too. I'm going to try to spot for him, but, uh, you know, he, he's, uh, you know, is, is that the number one error in World of Tanks, trying to do stuff all by yourself? I think the answer is yes. And I told him not to stop because I wanted him to get behind the bunker. I mean, tr try to salvage the situation, but uh, there's just too many vehicles coming and uh, nothing I could do. follow the action here and he, you know he's not even taking cover behind the bunker so the Hummel is going to have something to say about that and not only the Hummel but many other vehicles looked he stopped there you know ridiculous so there's the uh, there's the Hellcat I was talking about Max Muse he is still active in World of Tanks, and I'm definitely going to uh, contact him. Oh, we got a little pip squeak here. Uh, I have a feeling it's going to end badly for him. We shall see. Look at this tiger. Absolutely ridiculous. But as I said, um, you know, even if he was uh, the greatest player in World of Tanks, uh, I wouldn't save him. I, you know, I'm going to run away here. Okay, here's Max Muse's uh, performance. So let's count the shells. There's one. I hope these aren't gold rounds, Max Muse. That was the Dicker Max shooting. Two. My platoon mate is over there in his tier 7. 4. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. And you can see he can catch up to me. Nine. He's faster than me. Ten. Eleven. There's Elvis. Twelve. Thirteen. And 
The 14th shot, he tracks me. Repair my tracks. Elvis gets in some good damage on him, and I get the kill shot. There we are. And Elvis was hit by that uh, jumbo over there who apologized. Um, we won this game, and, uh, you know, it'll be awesome if Max Muse remembers this. So, so it's game over, and I uh, hope you enjoyed the video, guys. And I hope to find many more that resemble this in one way or another. So, see you next time.